welcome back to our YouTube channel, The Project Productions. I am Adrian Kim Fernandez, an architecture student, and this is Archilearns number 3. Kung hindi ka pa nakapag-subscribe, please like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell para maging updated ka sa mga videos ko about basic architecture, construction, and other related topics from my point of view as an artist student. Tara, sama niya ako matuto. The three virtues of architecture. So, ano nga ba itong pinatawag nilang Fermitas, Utilitas, and Venustas? Eh, di pag-aralan natin. Isa sa mga natutunan ko nung pumasok ako sa architecture school ay yung three virtues of architecture, namely Fermitas, Utilitas, and Venustas. Architects base their um, practice on many uh, standards. But uh, there is this shared three um, criteria for a piece of architecture uh, otherwise known as the Vitruvian Triad namely Venustas, uh, Utilitas, and Fermitas. Marcus uh, Vitruvius Polio uh, otherwise known as Vitruvius was a Roman architect and engineer during the first century BC. He was known for his uh, multi-volume work titled uh, The Architectura. So as he wrote his thoughts on architecture, um, the one that has perhaps uh, best stood the test of time uh, is his uh, three criteria, namely the uh, uh, Fermitas, Venustas, and Utilitas. So first, uh, let's talk about Fermitas. Fermitas refers to the uh, solidity or strength of a building. It refers to the building's ability to remain durable after extended use and uh, exposure to weathering, um, natural elements, uh, hazards, and phenomena such as um, uh, typhoon, flood, especially earthquakes. So basically here, uh, architects together with uh, other allied professionals such as the engineers um, consider uh, the structural in, uh, integrity of uh, a building when designing. Uh, this is to protect its uh, in, uh, future inhabitants. Siyempre, ayaw natin yung uh, bahay or building na nagtutwork o sumasayaw pag, uh, pag bumabagyo or may earthquake. So, ayaw natin nun, di ba? Walang ganun. Hindi pwede yung ganun. So, utilitas naman refers to the usefulness, function, or purpose of a building. It refers to the uh, ability uh, of a building to respond appropriately to the needs of its intended inhabitants because we have different types of buildings. We have uh, hospitals, we have uh, schools, we have um, residential or house, we have uh, office, and other uh, commercial buildings. So, architects usually design according to its function. So, as an example, uh, nasabi ko nga rin sa mga previous videos ko that uh, nasubukan ko rin na nagfabricate ng mga furniture like uh, cabinets, um, shelves, uh, dining table, computer table, etc. And uh, wag na tayo lumayo dahil uh, uh, architects also consider the appropriate um, furniture that is intended uh, for a specific area like a bedroom, uh, living room, uh, and dining area. One time, uh, a client uh, reached me out and asked if we could uh, fabricate dining tables uh, for their shop. So, uh, pagkakamali ko naman, uh, hindi na ako naging specific sa mga dimensions. Uh, and uh, hindi ko na rin natanong kung ano yung gagamitin nilang uh, chairs. So, dahil nag-assume ako ng kailangan nila ay dining tables kasi nag-tishop siya. So, uh, ang nangyari, nung pag-deliver namin ng mga tables, uh, matataas siya. Bakit? Kasi ang ginamit ng client na chairs ay mga sofa which uh, are usually intended for living area. Yung, uh, yun ang isa ng mga pagkakamali ko noon na sana tinanong ko muna or uh, naging specific ako sa mga um, uh, dimensions because uh, standard dimensions or uh, uh, the furniture uh, intended for uh, living area are different from the standard dimensions of uh, the furniture intended for the dining area. 
So, yun, ang ginawa na lang namin is uh, binalikan namin kasi uh, hindi siya comfortable na gamitin. Uh, matataas kasi siya and then yung mga upuan ng mga customer is mababa. So, yun ang naging isang problem noon at uh, experience ko. Which is why determining the uh, function or purpose of uh, a building or structure or even a furniture uh, is important in designing. Because architects also consider the standard dimensions of furniture, kitchen countertops, stairs, and room sizes of a building or a house. Last but not the least is uh, Venustas or beauty. It is a uh, building's relationship uh, to its context standard of aesthetics. Other aspects you could uh, consider are the level of craftsmanship and um, the attention to detail. Basically, under this um, virtue of architecture, uh, it focuses on the uh, appearance of a building or a structure that creates uh, emotions to its uh, users like uh, making them feel uh, happy, uh, calm, energized, or uplifted. And architects being the head designer of uh, a building or structure, they also consider this element uh, in order to create a good architecture. So yun, thank you for watching. Sana marami kayong natutunan ngayon. This is Arcularns number 3. See you on the next video. Bye!